Hi everyone, this is Chicho. Welcome to my channel and welcome to my patio. Now, what we're gonna do today, this morning, is harvest some uh, grape leaves that uh, we're gonna wash and put in the freezer and when we're ready, we're gonna use to make some dolmas, grape leaves dolmas. Now, this is something that I haven't done in the past. I've seen my grandmother and my mother and the rest of the uh, elders in the family do it for a number of decades, but I've never actually harvested the grape leaves myself. And I called up my mom and I asked her what I'm supposed to do. And uh, I knew basically, but I wanted to know if there's any little tricks that they had that I had to keep in mind that I hadn't noticed, right? But basically she told me just to cut the uh, grape leaves and I got a bowl of water here. So I'm just gonna put them in this, okay? And after we get a few, what I'm gonna do is add a little bit of salt onto the water and just give them a wash. And when they're wet, I'm gonna dry them a little bit and then I'm gonna you can either do it two ways. You can roll them up. That's what my grandma does. I'm not sure why she rolls it up, but she rolls it up and puts them in the freezer, right? But uh, my mom basically told me I can uh, harvest them and just wash them. Okay, let them dry a little bit or let them dry. And then just put them flat on top of each other and put it in the freezer. And then when I'm ready to make the dolmas, what I'm gonna do is uh, basically take the grape leaves out and put them in hot water. And what that does, it loosens up the grape leaves and then you can take the grape leaves one at a time and make your dolmas. And that's probably something what we're gonna do uh, during a cooking stream. Okay, aside from that, I'm gonna go and uh, get our grape leaves. And I got a, my uh, trusted kitchen scissors here. Okay, so I'm gonna bring them over and just put them in here. I'm not sure how much we're gonna harvest. We're gonna see. Um, but what you wanna do is harvest the grape leaves in the spring. Because in the spring, the grape leaves are fresh. They're coming out and we're in um, end of May right now. So I'm getting, we're getting close into summer, but I was waiting until the grape leaves were big enough, right? So you don't want to grab them, grab the grape leaves towards the end of summer or midsummer. You want to grab them towards, you know, mid spring, late spring, early spring, if they're coming out early because they're thinner, right? So you want the grape grape leaves to be thin you don't want them to be too thick because it just becomes a heavier dolma unless you want heavy dolma right but thinner dolma is uh, with the grape leaves is is really nice uh, thick enough that it doesn't break down uh, when you cook them okay so we're gonna harvest some grape leaves let's see how long this thing takes us So take a look, right? And I cut them right at the stem thing, right? And what we're gonna do is just, we're gonna throw them into the water. We got lots of birds singing and stuff. It's really nice outside. Sometimes you get these little bugs on the grapes, right? And there's some that do, and I go through and I try to find the leaves that have these little bugs, and they burrow in there, right? So you see them when, you know, there's, the grape leaves are 
puncturing out. You see these little defor deformities in the grape leaves. So you don't want these ones. So I'm going to throw this one over the balcony. It'll just become compost slowly, right? Um, but basically, these are the ones that you don't want. They got little deformities in them, and there's little bugs in there, right? Unless you want a little extra protein. <laughs> some dolma later probably in the summer right and this is a uh, grape vines that are coming over from our neighbor the the main grapes are from the neighbor that I came over the fencing that they have and I built that contraption there this sort of wall about when we came here we noticed the grape leaves i was like oh wow there's grape leaves coming i'm going to start directing i'm coming up the patio and i built that wall about three years ago and it took two years approximately for it to reach up to here and last year we had it canopy over us right so we got shade when we we're sitting down here and this year it's just growing i might I might start directing some of the leaves to come in this direction as well, right? So we get a nice little canopy and we're gonna have an area where we get lots of sun, right? Fantastic. shoots at the end of these two some of them have it ah this one's okay too we use look at this <laughs> oh, beautiful it's amazing having uh, your own plants and stuff that you can harvest in the just in your backyard, right? Let me submerge these. There we go. Right. And then what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna fill up the fill it, fill up the bowl with water and put salt in it and just give them a nice wash. Okay.
sometimes grab these where they're all bunched up together, right? That way, they have room to grow. My grandma would love this. Wow, wow, wow. If I get the opportunity, I'll bring her here for the summer. And we'll play backgammon. Yes, we will. You can harvest so much. Nah, this one's not good enough. Right. Awesome. Dolma, dolma.
I want them all to be facing the same way, right? Take a look. Look at this. <laughs> Lots of dolma. Lots of dolma. Just let them sink. Soak. eating a little bit so we're not gonna use this one we'll just throw it for the compost
Take a look at this one. This one got hit hard, right? You see them in the back? We'll get rid of this one. Yeah, let's throw it there for now. But these ones are good. Oh, there's one here. Take a look. This one's been hit too. Okay. This. Come here, little guy. Look at this. Little ant got caught up. Where is it going? So 
batches of dolma which is good for a first try right fantastic morning gang i hope you're having an amazing amazing morning i hope you have an amazing afternoon i hope you have an amazing evening i hope you have an amazing 
amazing life. Okay. Bye for now. Should we listen to the birds a little bit?